And we're back in the game with some more Rome Total War, our Burby Condita mod, playing as Bactria. Right, we're jumping straight into, bar into a battle, apparently. Uh, where? Outside of Sidon. Okay, we do need to activate our scripts. You can see that we're going to be heavily outnumbered. 3,850 men, most, but... They're very low tier, they just have a lot of numbers. We may run out of ammunition. Can't see what's inside Sidon, but Sidon is a huge city, I believe, and we're going to make a lot of money if we capture it. That's the army that was sitting outside of Antioch. So we do have a full stack in Antioch and a full stack out here to uh, carry on the campaign, win or lose. Would be nice to win, but you know how heavily outnumbered. And there's a Roman Tortuga, or Tortoise. And it does in fact work very well in this mod. Uh, even the AI uses it. So it looked like most of their forces were going to show up from behind us, didn't it? So we're going to try and kill off those in front. No, most of them were coming from in front. It was the garrison was coming from behind us. It looked like. Uh, can we see where the garrison is going to come? Don't see any roads. There, there's the settlement back there. So, back. That's where they'll be coming from. But they could be delayed. And in fact, there's a good chance they'll come along this road. So. Let's go ahead and place those two units there. We can harass them if they do come out. Go ahead and get up there. Right. And we almost got it right. We got very close there. One of you is already firing. up there. They're on the flank. You can start shooting them. Not nope. being aggressive with that cavalry unit, but a very light cavalry. We'll shoot them to pieces. Right, you're on you're not even on skirmish mode there. That's our general. That's so good. Like everyone else is off a skirmish. Right. Who are we even shouting, shooting at? Yep. <laughs> he shamed himself. Then he got run down. Well, shame on him. Shame on him. Uh... We are taking a fair amount of casualties. We are killing more than losing. It's that cavalry that I was disrespecting, they're like Cav. The other one's doing a lot of the damage. You know, my rally. Need to be up here, killing off these bigger units. Yep, they actually rallied, didn't they? Okay, they are broken. Oh, we've got another unit has routed. Alright, that unit's broken. We need to concentrate on those bigger units. Can win this one. 12 to 22. Not killing 2 to 1. But we will. Didn't even pay attention to those units that they had coming out of the city. It's probably one of those over there. Alright, get over here. Oh, Bedouin camels have broken. Yeah, they're being uh, more aggressive than I expected. 
thing is, we need all the ammunition and all the men that we get. They're still going to be a heavily outnumbered. Only need to kill off those spearmen. I think we're killing off most of their cavalry now. Their missile units. Okay, doing slightly better. There's still somebody out there fighting. Don't run into that unit. One. Those are just sitting there, getting shot, hopefully. Looks like there's a sandstorm coming in. Another unit is broken there. These bro uh, units are breaking. I'm not coming back to the battle. They are leaving the battlefield. Come on, you've got the mobility. So that 92 men in that unit. Very disappointing. Still got more men back there. Alright, that one came back. Come on, break some of these smaller units. Uh, they broke again. Oh, there's more of their light cavalry. Killed half their forces, I just don't think we have enough men or ammunition to get the job finished. Six percent of them are gone. There goes our general's unit yet again. Oh, we're whittling them down. They just had a all oh, these big units or units with 240 plus men in them. Take some doing to kill them off. Those peltasts don't have the range to kill us. Or well, they shouldn't. Yeah, we're going to run out of units, aren't we? They're actually doing a good job, aren't they? Because these peltasts would normally get killed off fairly easily. Oh, there's three of our units. You're actually out of ammunition. Do we even have anyone for you to go and kill? Well, as I said, we've got extra units that will have to come back. Yep, there's all of our ammunition gone, and many of our units. It's going to be suicidal, but...
Come on, keep shooting them. Yep, well, this one's actually broke. Up there after that one. Broken that one. Okay, we're going to break those. But if they keep their pikes up, we might. I'm going to kill off quite a few of them. Don't get hung up on that one. Or if you do, try to kill them. Actually killing a fair number of them. See if you can get them while they got the bikes facing in the opposite direction. Oh, they're gone. Ah, uh, all of our units broke. Thought we had that unit. Well, we killed um, seventy-seven percent. So, I think what hers was that uh, general dying right at the start. Even though he was a captain, that didn't help. I mean, we almost got 3,000 kills. So we're going to send both of those armies down from Antioch. Ah, I have no idea where that army came from. Right, uh, we have a chance of killing more Parthians. This is only a town. I think in the last episode we looked and there was only about 500 men there. So there's basically nothing. Um, trash units. We're not going to see what's in there. But expect the Parthians to have a lot of horse archers as well, but they haven't been fielding that many. Before the night comes, is that Joe Cocker song? Now oh, that's when the night comes, isn't it? Okay. The ferryman will be busy today. Ferryman. Oh, we've got a high advantage up here. Might as well make use of it. Try to get rid of this force. It's only two cavalry and two spare units. Those horsemen will do damage because they've got javelins if they can get close enough. Probably taking a lot of friendly fire. That's okay. As long as we get rid of more Parthian settlements. Oh yeah, they're all breaking. Hold your ground and just shoot them. I think I'll send my general just to go and mop them up. And then deploy these back here. No, that is not Stonehenge. Although it is a henge. A henge being a group of standing stones, usually in a circle. Look at that, still under construction. Hmm. Somebody's been slacking off of their religious duties
Oh, that unit actually rallied. If you get a volley off, they're going to do some damage. Of course, they might not have any ammunition. Alright, go and finish them off unless they come for you. Ooh, seems like they actually have the range to get to our general. Or is that those ones? Come on, chase them. I'm actually taking a lot of casualties. Is he going to catch them? Yeah. Go on. Make them pay. The enemy show their true virtue. They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits running. Yeah, teach them a lesson. Well, there's 39 up there. You can get to them. They're actually heading back in the wrong direction. Uh, I don't think he's going to catch them, no. We're after those. Alright, those other units. They don't look like they want to come out and challenge you, do they? Alright. See what they have in their army. Spearmen, probably hillmen, and probably more horsemen. Did I put them back on guard mode? I don't remember doing it. Are they going to pull back? I have the feeling they're going to pull back. Let's see if they'll pull back. Seriously, they do not want to engage us, do they? Oh, I think the general caught up to that unit. Well, they've got somebody in their army that can actually fire. Those horsemen should not have that great a range. Or oh, javelins. Was that a unit of horse hunters I saw in the enemy? Yes, it was. Let's try to get more out on their flank. Should be slaughtering all of those units. One, it's just one unit of horsemen. Can't kill those off. We should be destroying these units because they don't have much in the way of armor. They did have some slingers. Slingers will do well against horse archers normally.
can't be many of them left. those horse archers the enemy army is in flight pursue them we are we are pursuing them well maybe enough of them Get back into that settlement. Maybe not. It is a fairly worthless settlement. I mean, did we get 93%? Yep. 130%. -ish got away. Nope, we are going to claim it. And there's their faction there trying to break out from our trap yet again. Oh, we actually got some kills. He's trying to get back to his capital, isn't he? We have. Yeah, see, it's basically worthless. We're going to have public order problems there. Right. Enemy army routes. So I was in an end turn. So we missed some messages. Right. So what happened to those forces? Is that the remainder? I think it is. So I'm going to send you down to there. I am going to send out all force. And this general is getting a nice discount on our unit recruitment. So I need a lot of cavalry to come. Right. So always a risk sending an army without a general in it. Get those units in there. Get one of them to come down there. Right. Yes, Stratigos, sir. My lord, sir. Orders. Forward. Let's see what was going on in rest of our empire. So, we allied to the Greeks. Got a diplomat. Over here. My lord, I shall speak with them at once. No, you can offer more. All right, that's as close as we're going to get. Now, let's see if we can find the Gauls. Oh, there are some Gauls still left. Alright. Now, we've got this army that was moving along the coastline there. Oh, Seleucids do still have some more powerful ships left. Right. So they didn't try to break the siege there. They're probably going to come up here. How many units we got there? I'm going to drop that all the way down. Getting a small discount, so I'm going to take out all of that cavalry. Try to get them up there. No, still very happy, aren't they? We could probably pull out almost all of those units. We've got a big population. Uh, there was an enemy spy there last time. Alright, 
port. That's the port for the settlement that we just captured. There's obviously a port up here somewhere. Scythian docks, yep. And we do here, if anything. Yeah, we're going to have trouble. Unrest, distance to capital. No. I think we're just going to destroy these. And let it rebel. Even if it goes back to being Parthian. I'm just going to leave smallest unit behind I can. Guess it's that one. Now, I could go after the Scythians. But I want to find out, and it kind of looks like there are more Parthians up here somewhere. So, yeah, I'm going to let it rebel. Get some money out of it. Oh, and some rebels popped up over there. I think we recruited a unit there. Right. I'm going to send you over there. Need to find out what's up here in any case. Aha, there he is. And he is gathering forces, isn't he? Right. Forward. No more moves, sir. Yes, Stratigos. Forward. Now trying to block off those uh, routes for him. Now we've got an army here, full stack. It's just going to take forever to get down. guess we claimed that at the end of the last episode. We might be able to hold on to it. Is it worth it though? I mean, we'll be fighting just to keep an income of 476 and a couple of terrible buildings. Now, I'm going to destroy those as well and abandon the settlement. Well, I don't even think I'm going to leave a unit in there. Sir. I am going to come straight down here. So, do that. My Lord. In another unit. Because there are bigger settlements out here. There's one there. The capital is usually there. And there's another settlement over there with another one up there. I know this because I've played a Sabean campaign, or I am playing a Sabean campaign. Alright, let's go through and see if there are any buildings that we need to construct anywhere. Because we've got 92,000 in our treasury. Okay, we'll do some public health works. Uh, that road will help. Alright. Athena because there is a lot of corruption. Not too much squalor there. Got 5% growth already. Why is that? Hmm. Well, you're making good money, 3,500, so I'm going to put that in. You need to retrain those units. Yeah, you have a long way to go to upgrade.
Who need that? I don't think so. Well, there's no corruption there, but we have to keep them happy. You look like you need to be happier. Squalor there, 50%. Right, I think we want you growing. Merv. Right. So got a good amount of money. One second, we're going to put another unit on that bridge. Would like to send one round to there. Okay, we've got a Sclepios there. Ooh, we're starting to get a lot of corruption there. Why did we put Sclepius for public health? Because we wanted our generals to be fruitful. Right, and I'm going to put that one in. We may have to convert that temple again. Yeah, I think that's everywhere, isn't it? Still got 31,000 left. But we shall be spending that in the next episode. And so, until then... Take care.